we have clean skin, we have all of our electrodes placed, you can see that the temporalis, masseters, digastrics, and SEMs are all attached. We have our ground electrode wire, which comes out of the top here, attached to the electrode that's here on the shoulder. If we turn the patient just a little bit like this, you can see that as I go to attach the masseter electrode, I just take the two alligator clips that plug into channel two here, the medial masseter, and I'm going to clip one alligator clip to each of the tabs, just opening up the alligator clip, sliding it underneath the tab, and letting it close. We'll do the same thing for the temporalis, sliding the electrode underneath the tab, and letting it close. All right, we'll go ahead and look forward. Now we have the temporalis, masseters, digastrics, SCMs, and our ground electrode all attached to the wires. All of the wires are plugged into the amplifier box. The ground goes here in the top, red, gray, blue, and purple wiring. The last thing we need to make sure of before we begin to record electromyography is that we switch from JVA only to EMG. By pressing this button on the top of the amplifier box right here, we now illuminate the EMG light and all of these channels are open and ready to record electromyography.